What film studio wouldn't want to make a movie in Hawaii? Another one has signed on for a big budget flick this fall and is looking for extras. KITV Force Paul Drews goes to auditions. Special effects and Hollywood stars fill many blockbuster movies. But these big productions also include everyday people cast as extras. And many want to fill that role. It's exciting. I've, I've wanted to be in the movies since I was a little kid. At this open casting call, hundreds lined up to be part of the next big film, even if they didn't know what that movie would be. I think it would be pretty cool. Uh, it's a new, something new for me. Like I've never done anything outside of my comfort zone, so it would be a new experience. I want to get some exposure, have some fun, get away from real life. Along with making sure those auditioning are the right fit for a particular scene, they're also looking to see if anyone has any hidden talents. We saw some people walk on their hands, sing, uh, dance. There was poetry. There was, there was someone who could do some very unusual eye movements, and then somebody who could do some unusual finger movements. <laughs> so we had we had a good group, and you never know what's coming in in the next group. My poor mother. Uh, last week she goes, Patrick. Do me a favor, if I ever seem like I'm getting Alzheimer's, please tell me. I was like, Mom, I told you three times last week. <laughs> Contortionist and comedian showed off their additional skills that could be useful in some future film. Alessi didn't say which film would start shooting next month, but we've learned it'll be the latest King Kong movie. At this casting call, hopeful extras did learn there'd be no monkeying around while they're on the set. When you work on a film, you have to be on set for around 12 hours of the day. You have to commit to the whole day. You can't bring your friends. You can't take pictures of the cast. Being cast as an extra in a movie doesn't always mean you'll be able to see yourself on the big screen. Even after all the takes and hard work, some scenes still don't make the final cut. We did Godzilla. We did probably one scene 20 times, and it didn't even make it on the set. So it's it's disappointing when you're you know you don't end up on there, or your family doesn't end up on there. But uh, but it's worth it. It's fun. Paul Drews, KITV4 News.